As a kid, that was one of my first main kind of entrances into what I wanted to say as an artist and how I wanted to inspire strength in young women. I thought that you would surprise me Get on a plane and come find me But instead you surprise me I guess it isn't surprising Hi, my name is Mahalia and these are my five essential tracks. So my first pick is India Irie, I Am Not My Hair. And this song for me, it was, it was kind of just, when I was a kid, I struggled so much with like working out how I wanted to have my hair. And I guess, I think it's a, it's a struggle that a lot of young women of colour experience because I guess for me it was like, I grew up in a predominantly white town and I was always looking at girls who had straight hair and I was like, God, like India Irie is just, basically saying like I am not what my hair is and so like there's there is more to me than what sits on top of my head little girl with the press and curl AJ I got a jerry curl 13 and I got a relaxer I was a source of so much laughter it really resonated with me as a kid and so I think as a kid that was one of my first main kind of entrances into what I wanted to say as an artist and how I wanted to inspire strength in young women and I remember I used to my mum had a wardrobe that had four mirrors all the way along it and I used to go into her bedroom and dance in the mirrors and sing it and yeah so yeah it's that is definitely one of my favorite songs so my next pick is is Amy Winehouse Tears Drown My Own and this one now I've always been a massive fan of Amy Winehouse anyway and actually picking an Amy song for this I found quite difficult because there are so many of them that really kind of made me. I loved this song mainly because I felt like it was her stepping into a new world. And in your way, in this blue shade, my tears dry on their own. I remember her, her debut album, Frank, I loved. But when Back to Black came out with this song on, I was just like, whoa, like this is a whole new side of Amy that I've never seen. And I was pretty young. Um, but I actually, I, I, I love this song also because of the video. And when I watched her in that video and she's walking and I'm pretty sure she's wearing like a, maybe a blue, like baby blue dress and, and she has the beehive. And it was like the first time that you really saw the beehive. I just found her so amazing to watch. And I just found that song and everything she was saying in it. I must have been about 11 or 12 when she died. Um, and I, I honestly like full body found it really hard because I was like wow, wow like you you inspired so much of me like you make up so much of what I am and she was always someone that I wanted to see and I wanted to meet so um yeah I was definitely good but but she is that there is no doubt that, that that everything about her and her legacy still lives on so this song um is by Corin Bailey Rain it's called Like a Star she just Oh, her voice, everything, her vocals, her lyrics, the sound was so, it felt really fresh, but it had so much like old soul um, influences in there. And I just, I just thought she was amazing. And like a star, just like a star across my sky, just like an angel of the page, you have appeared to my life, feel like I'll never be the same. And with this song, like oh, Corin Bailey Ray was the first album that I ever bought. And I remember when you bought the album, you got a poster. And the poster, I've got a photo of me lying on a bed in like bright red Christmas pajamas. And the poster of her is, on, is, is at the side of my wall. And it's just so soft and so sweet. And, and I, love, I love that it's sweet, but she's actually saying... I don't argue with anybody like I argue with you and I, and, and I actually fucking hate you, but, but you're amazing and we're together and it makes sense. And I just, I just really loved that whole thing. And, and, and I actually really, even now, like I really relate to it. So, okay, so this is actually a funny, this is a weird one and everybody, everyone who's watching is going to think that I'm really silly for this, but being honest, I just love Dolly Parton. I think she is, again, another strong woman and she's amazing and what she writes is so beautiful and I, I, I love her glamour and I love everything about her so I 
I mean, I'm 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 a massive romantic, and anyone who knows my music kind of knows that. And I I just love the whole like the way that she is talking to a woman and saying, Jolene, I'm begging of you, please don't take my man. I just thought it was really just like really weirdly sad but funny, and I loved it. So the last song on my list is Mardi Bum by Arctic Monkeys. Now, this song is my favourite, I guess, out of the five, because this song, this one for me was like, it, it was the first time that I'd heard somebody singing like, like me. Not a money boom, oh, I'm in trouble again, aren't I? I thought as much. I remember my dad saying, saying Mardi Bum when I was a kid. So when I heard that song, I was like, oh my God, my dad says that. And he calls me that. Um, and so I guess that for me was just more the fact that it felt close and it felt like I could relate to it. And, and I just, yeah, I just think they're sick. And I, it was my brother who introduced me to them when I was super young. And um, that's how I started playing guitar. So I guess they like, bands like the Arctic Monkeys and even bands like the Kooks, um, they were kind of my first introduction to singer-songwriting and playing the guitar and singing. And everybody always mentions my influences being um, the kind of greats. And they are greats like, like India and like Erica Badu and Lauren Hill and Jill Scott and Angie Stone. And all of those amazing women are totally who inspire me. But when I really think about when I was first starting, it was indie bands like the Arctic Monkeys that just excited me. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, and if you want to comment your favorite song, then you can put it in the comments below. And if you want to see any more videos like this, then you can see them all on this channel.